I woke up with this thought on today. Sometimes we have to ask God to fix us because sometimes my brothers and my sisters, we are the problem. Understand that the journey to self-improvement begins with honest reflection, recognizing that we often hold the key to our own growth and our own improvement. While it's easy, and we know it's easy, to blame other people and external factors for our struggles, we understand that true transformation occurs when we take responsibility for our own actions and our own choices. Understand by placing faith in God and leaning on his strength, we equip ourselves with the resilience needed to face challenges and grow. Each obstacle, my brothers and my sisters, becomes an opportunity for us to grow, allowing us to shed our old patterns and our old attitudes and embrace the person that God has called us to be. Trusting in God's guidance, we can cultivate a mindset that empowers not only our own development, but also it positively affects our community. I want you to remember, every step taken with intention and faith is a step toward becoming the best version of ourselves. So let us strive simply to be better on today. May we pray. Gracious Heavenly Father, we come now just to say thank you. We thank you for being a sovereign God. We thank you for being a merciful God. We thank you for loving us in spite of who we are, what we think, what we say, and what we do. And right now, Father, before we rush into your presence, we simply ask you to forgive us of our sins. And we ask you to create in us a clean heart and to renew a steadfast spirit within us, restoring to us the joy of your salvation. And on today, Father, as we start afresh, we ask you, Lord, to give us a mindset to simply examine ourselves because sometimes we are the issue. Give us a mindset, Father, to turn away from the old things and embrace what you have for us on today. Help us to shed the guilt and the anger of the past. And we ask you, Lord, to put joy in our hearts so that we can move forward for your glory and for your honor. We ask you to bless us as we go out to labor in your vineyard. Give us the mindset to be loving channels to and for your glory. We ask you to protect us, Lord. As we go forth, we ask a special prayer on our churches, Lord. We ask you to unify us. We ask you to bless those who are dealing with sickness. We ask you to bless those who are dealing with struggles, Lord. We ask you to bless our children on today as they go forth. Protect them in this dark world, Lord. Be their light. Be their guide. Lord, we just thank you on today for all that you have done for us. And we just simply ask you to give us a mindset to be better. Better in the way we walk better in the way we love, better in the way we serve, so that we can do the work that you have called us to do. So we simply ask you to be with us now as we go forth into this new day we have never, ever seen before. Fall afresh in our hearts. Bless our brothers and our sisters, for thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory. Forever we pray, amen, amen, and amen. And remember, simply strive to be better. God bless you.